I'm Alessandro Bertero and I direct the Harvard Amnese Laboratory of Heart Engineering and Developmental Genomics at the University of Torino in Italy. I started my laboratory with the support of the Amnese Foundation after returning uh, from the United States uh, where I spent my postdoc years at the University of Washington in Seattle. And before that I was at the University of Cambridge in the United Kingdom for my PhD. In our group we are interested in learning how the heart is built during normal development, how this goes wrong when uh, there are congenital malformations, and then to leverage this technology to develop engineering strategies to repair the malformed heart. And we do this by using human-induced pluripotent stem cells as models, which we can differentiate into cardiac myocytes. And we apply this technology together with genome editing to probe the specific effect of mutations. And we hope that by developing these disease models, we are then able to identify strategies that can help the patients. But we also want to use the same cells in order to regenerate the heart of these patients where the defect is too big. And so for this, we want to grow a large number of cardiac myocytes that can be used to regenerate the heart uh, by direct transplantation. Last but not least, we think that our technologies can be applied also outside of the medical field, particularly in the emerging area called cellular agriculture, whereby the goal is to generate animal products such as meat without the need of slaughtering animals. These seemingly unrelated aspects actually rely on the same set of core knowledge and key enabling technologies. It all starts by understanding how the heart is developed normally, and then to engineer cells in order to generate cardiac muscle and other type of muscle very efficiently. And we decided to specifically tackle congenital heart defects because these are the most common cause of congenital birth defects affecting 1% of live births. And then we also uh, want to impact on the ability to regenerate the heart of single ventricle disease patients because this is a disease where there is no uh, known cure. And lastly, by providing an alternative to conventional intensive farming for the production of meat, we think we can improve generally the human sustainability on our planet. Mm -hmm.